Today, my friends, welcome back to The Crew 2, where we have a brand new set of cars to check out. This is the first one. It's called the Bentley Molina. It's a big boy. And this big boy is about to be tuned by the pants, and you already know it's going to look even spicier once we are done. It's known as the Bentley Molina, and it is, in fact, also... One of the first convertible cars in the crew. You've, you've not seen it before. It's crazy. It's beautiful. It's incredible. It looks like a concept car just like my LC looks like a concept car. This looks like a current concept car. There's no tire whatsoever. Back end is a little bit tame, but I think the front of it looks great. I'm not usually a Bentley person, but I think this looks cracking. Let's try it out. Now, I'm hoping this thing's going to be super spicy. And look at the beautiful 60 frames on PC. I only just switched it on. And now I'm sorry. Oh, that's got a new meaty sound. You know, playing on PC really makes me want to switch to PC. Because just look how good this game looks. And the smoothness of it. If you're not watching in 60 frames, I would highly recommend if you can. 1440p if you can as well. Because it looks so much better on racing games. All right, let's get it. It feels heavy. It feels so heavy. Is this like fully upgraded? No hero allowed. It's so meaty, so heavy, so big. And it feels it. Now, there have been some major changes to the progression apparently of this game. I don't know. We're going to hopefully do some experimenting and find out. But apparently they've made progression a little bit easier, which I'm going to welcome just a little bit, but... Again, I don't want to say until we properly try it, because I kind of liked having a game that required a little bit of effort. Most games don't take effort these days, and it's kind of sad. Yeah, everything is maxed out. I could tell by the NOS, but we've got 1,100 horsepower from this big old beast. 2.4 seconds on the NOS 60. That's Tesla speed, baby. Okay, it's about time we do some bits. I need to make more use of this upstairs garage, because it's just it's such a nice setting. Okay, let's jump into the customization. Now, just... Obviously, very clear. This is me playing early access. It'll say down in the description if it's early access or not. That's why. I, listen, do you think I would have this much money on my? No. <laughs> like, it's easy to make money in this game, but it ain't that easy. You know what I'm saying? Okay, let's jump in. I'm so glad that this has got visual parts because the customization is what I need. Color wise, I do kind of like the yellow. Probably not going to change it. He says, as he then switches through to the blue and the gold. I wish they'd had more iridescent colors. I say it all the bloody time. I really, really want it though. That's a better gold, honestly. I kind of like that. I feel like the gold kind of makes sense. Because I'm the big punsy. Look at me, I'm a big Bentley. Ooh. Exactly. Oh. So we have rim customization. <laughs> okay. Right? Not really going to change those. We've got caliper colors and interior color. Damn! Damn. I was hoping for a little bit more spice, if you know what I'm saying. But the fact it's in the game at all is beautiful. I'm kind of I'm kind of happy. All right, so interior color, we've got it black currently. We'll put a little bit of more gold in there. Full gold. Convert the interior a little bit. Change it from carbon. Are you crazy? So, of course... There we are. Now, there are some no new vanity parts, which I clearly don't have access to, but I can get them. If we go over to the new motor pa Oh, we're actually going to get introductions to the- Season 2, champ. Thank Your you! favorite Lara here, Motorflix's stunt coordinator. We're shooting our new action TV series. The Agency. The Agency! I'm going to show you no more. I don't want to be no spoily spoily, but here we go. We're going to jump and buy the premium motor pass, which I really want- what are these wheels? There are some weird, weird wheels available in this version. I... Look at this. What the heck is going on? And I've just figured out how you unlock this car in the update. I should have told you this earlier. This car is unlocked through the motor pass. But of course, in this update, I already have like, early access to it myself because it's the early access to show you guys. But it's in the free version of the motor pass. So do not worry, my friends. Get access to it by just going through the motor pass, which is super easy. But there's no customization other than vanity. I'm hoping if my vanity items ain't applicable. Oh, there's tires. Interesting. So we've got some brand new smokes, which we're definitely going to try these. That's like a molten lava of some kind. Let's go for that. We've got underglow options. 
That's just a bit weird. <laughs> we got window tints. We got a gold window tint that moves. And of course, we can't put those blooming wheels on. Of course we can't. Bloody Bentley. I'm not sure what I think about this tint. It, it looks good when it first starts to set off. Like, I will so, show you. I'll show you. Ready, ready, ready? There. That looks good. Past that, it's like, come on, man. You're being a little bit crazy. All right. Let's have a look at this. Holy crap. <laughs> what the hell? That's just a little bit freaky if you ask me. I don't know what to think. I'm j I am a little bit disappointed, I will say, the fact that the customization is just gone. Like, I really, really, really would like to put a big old wing on this. But there are some cars that are definitely going to be able to, and I'm very much looking forward to. You're going to see those super quick. But let's jump into the interior view just to have a look at this car. I'm going to tell you right now, it does not feel quick. It's probably also an issue that I'm playing in 60 frames a second, so it actually feels... I don't know, the sense of speed is just thrown off quite a bit. I really hope this is it. We need a 60 FPS update on the con on the console versions. Please, mate. But here we are. It does some mega pops. Go on, get a pop in the tunnel, please. Pop. Come on. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Takes a little bit of time. It's very grippy, but overall feels very slow. And this is so distracting, having molten lava come out the back of my car. I was hoping it was just maybe when I wheel spin. <laughs> Because, you know, lighting up the ground with my big old tires. It makes sense. Now, normally I would jump into PvP to properly show you guys how good or not good a car is. But unfortunately, again, it is early access. I'm actually going to pop in here. It is early access, so I'm not quite yet able to jump into PvP. Because not many people will be playing right now, as you can probably imagine. But it looks good. I like it. It's a concept car in the crew. And you know me, I like concept cars being added to the game. Again, I hope that maybe at some point in the future, maybe they'll decide to add customers. Probably not. I kind of wanted to remove some of the rear tire grip. It's already just wheel spinning constantly because this is such a big boat that I think, honestly, it's best use maybe having its tail out. <laughs> I don't know. It feels a bit odd. My help if there was no bloody traction control. Good, big brain. But this is definitely not practical. I'm really not going to recommend it to anyone with a brain. But I do not have one. Brain is not required here on the patch. I've got too much grip again. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, nice little power slides. At least that's something. <laughs> we tried. It, on the, with a bit more space. Hey, we're onto something. But today, nah. <laughs> that's, that's going back. No, thank you. Let me know your thoughts on this car. Is it something you're going to try and grind for? Are you just going to buy it? Do you really want it? And you're just going to pay the money? Or do you not really care? Even though it's, you know, I highly recommend just, just play every day, every other day, and you'll, you'll get a no job. Do the dailies. This is definitely not my favorite car of the update just because of the customization. I think it could have been if it had it, I mean, the uh, launch of the update, because of course more cars will be unlocked over time. Be sure to smash like, subscribe if you're new, and let me know your thoughts on this car down below. Are you ready for the update? It drops very, very soon. Details down below in the description. Be sure to smash like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next time. Peace.